At the turn of the third century, the Han Dynasty was in decline, and the land was thrust into a time of rival warlords struggling for power. While all the various sages competed to think of brilliant strategies, the cleverest man in the land, Zhuge Liang, merely tended his fields, serving no particular master. However, a visit from a gentle and righteous wanderer by the name of Liu Bei caused his life to change. Struck by his sincerity and lofty ideals, Zhuge Liang came forth, intending to use his wisdom to help realize Liu Bei's dream. Yes, I understand. I, Zhuge Liang, wish to help. I will do all that is in my power to help you create your vision. You have my gratitude. However, you must know that yours will not be an easy path. What awaits you is years of wandering and waiting, of carefully laid plans and strategies. In the difficulties that you will face, you must always remember your purpose and never sway from your path. I will not sway. What will bring about your vision in the end is not my strategies, but your heart and how true you will stay. Must shake off this pursuit. Hurry to the docks and Guan Yu. Lord Liu Bei, take us with you. We wish to follow you and see a new world. Yes, come with us on our journey. Those who can fight protect those who cannot. <laughs> greater weapon than a prepared mind. You believe your wits are a match for mine? <laughs> There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. I had so wanted to see the world he would have made. 
cowards dare to attack the people, your acts will not be forgiven nor forgotten. My beauty must not be soiled by defeat. I shall return. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. You're doing great. I will try to live up to your example. I have come for your head. We can't hold out any longer. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Those are innocent people. I cannot allow such cruel acts to continue. The docks are just ahead. Just a little bit farther. We're almost there. My lord, enemy reinforcements are approaching. Lord, enemy reinforcements are approaching. you ever survive this long? You stand in the way of my cousin's fate. That ends today. My lord, enemy reinforcements have arrived. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. No greater weapon than a prepared mind. Amazing! We will have to display our strength as well! I have come for your head! <laughs> there is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Face me, would you? Very well. This is part of your plan. Here I go.
greater weapon than a prepared mind. You're doing great. I will try to live up to your example. back for now. However, we shall meet in battle again. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. That was close. Thank you for aiding us. Men, we must hold them back. It's do or die. My lord, enemy reinforcements are approaching! We're gonna have to try harder than this! Bases are merely pawns in my larger strategy. Now that's how it's done. You inspire us all. Lose? 
I didn't even think that was possible. Mark me? Don't make me laugh. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Yeah, I'm gonna squash you! There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Amazing! We will have to display our strength as well! This escape is a victory for us! Well done, everyone! The outcome turned out as I had planned. Great number, but that will not benefit us in a fight. Most of them will only be in the way. However, there are more than I ever would have expected. These people have given their trust to our Lord. I had not imagined what an encouraging sight that could be. Look at them all. I'll shoulder the burden of their trust to create a better world for them to live in. Now I see. This is a task that I shall find satisfaction in accomplishing. Thanks to the efforts of Zhuge Liang and the other warriors, Liu Bei was able to shake off Cao Cao's pursuit. Afterwards, Liu Bei sent Zhuge Liang as an ambassador to arrange an alliance with Sun Quan. However, Cao Cao was there to lead his naval forces into battle. After settling with Wu, Zhuge Liang formed up his lines to attack Cao Cao at Qi Bi and gave orders to Zhao Yun to go and secure a base for Liu Bei. 
Above the Great River, Zhuge Liang laid plans to realize his secret stratagem, the division of China into three kingdoms. My lord, we are now at the start. We have allied with Wu and stand opposed to Cao Cao. From this point on, I shall make use of all my skills so that we may remove all uncertainty from your dream and make it reality. Yes, I will depend on you. We can have no success without your helping us. Then the time has come. You must begin to head to the west. West? My lord will not find his victory at Qi Bi. I have already sent Master Zhang Fei and Master Zhao Yun to grasp the victory that awaits my lord in the west. An excellent plan. Then I will travel west. I shall take my leave. My lord, do not ever let yourself forget your true purpose. We must drive off Wei's boats. Zhou Yu, I leave command of the army to you. It is almost time. I shall begin preparations at the altar. Then we shall prepare the fire. Huang Gai, head for the boats. for your head. The enemy is very strong. We are being forced back. Huang Ga, wait there for a time. You must move when the wind blows to the southeast. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Indeed, you will carry our honor across the land. Leaving this place would not be beneficial. I will take up its defense. Ha! <laughs> 
Come on! I know you are capable of more than this. You believe your wits are a match for mine? Now, let's go! What have I done? I am ashamed yet thankful for your assistance. I have come for your head! The boats will move when they hear this god. And then, our path to the enemy will be open. However, the enemy will also be able to attack us. We must be careful when you move the boats. We have allowed the proper time to pass. Here I go not call forth the wind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. We weren't clever enough to overcome this threat. Up, we're finished! Here I go. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Face me if you think you are worthy. <laughs> An excellent display of skill. We shall fight again. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. We can't hold out any longer. army appears determined to win this battle. The enemy looks tough. Come on, guys. Put your backs into it. I hate losing a fight, but this time I've got no choice. The enemy is a finely tuned unit. This will not be easy. Without carrying out my plan. Never have I known such shame. Seems there is still more for me to learn. I must retreat. You fight alone? Yes. Have you no friends? There is 
no greater weapon than the prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than the prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than the prepared mind. A true warrior indeed! You will carry our honor across the land! Here I go. There is no greater weapon than the prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than the prepared mind. A true warrior indeed! You will carry our honor across the land! This is part of my plan. Bases are merely pawns in my larger scatter. Let us finish this. I'm hungry, so that's it for today. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. We may not be able to make it through this. Let us finish this. You think you outsmart me? Don't make me laugh. Let us finish this. Let us finish this. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. We must rouse ourselves for this fight! Let us finish this. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Bases are merely pawns in my larger strategy. Your 
I go. Oh, well done. I'll have to try and keep up. Let us finish this. There is no bigger weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. We must rouse ourselves for this fight! My strategies shall be studied for centuries to come. Men, we must hold them back! It's do or die! There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. are merely pawns in my larger strategy.
bases are merely pawns in my larger strategy. By defeat, I shall return. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. You have allowed your pride to overcome your senses. One person cannot decide a battle. Here I go. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. You have done much, and I applaud you. But if you are not for me, then you are against me. Here I go. Not yet extinct. There is no greater weapon than a prepared mind. Cao Cao's forces have pulled back. Raise the call for victory. We have won. The outcome turned out as I had planned. You have arrived. Now, we will meet with our lord first, then on to Zhang. We go to Zhang province then. During the battle at Qi Bi, we took the province of Jing. Jiang is now in our possession. 
All this is a stepping stone, so that we might gain control over Yi province. Now I see. Quite clever. We need to grow in strength, and Yi is where we can do it. But to do it with such guile... Even guile is of use. Conventional fighting will not achieve our Lord's goals. The Battle of Chi Bi ended in victory for the Liu and Sun forces. At the same time, the other officers subdued the principal city of Jing province as per Zhu Geliang's orders. In addition, Liu Bei's forces moved west, focusing on acquiring Yi province and stretching out beyond Jing. Yi was a fertile land protected from the elements a perfect base for Liu Bei in his quest to rival Cao Cao and Sun Quan for power. But the ruler of Yi was another member of Liu Bei's own family, Liu Zhang. Liu Bei agonized over the act of turning against his own kin to further his goals. I tell you, I have difficulty understanding Master Liu Bei at times. I wish a few of those big brutes surrounding him would knock some sense into his head. I understand. But nonetheless... I know, I know. That is why they all follow him. I do feel for you though, Zhuge Liang. Thanks to his gentle nature, your strategies look especially cruel. I do not care. I will do all that I can. I do not seek a reward. It is for Liu Bei to be loved, not me. Yes, you are right. That is true. Then let us do what is necessary to create the path for that gentleman, and help him change this harsh world of ours. Right, Zhuge Liang? <laughs> <laughs> 